Hello everyone, my name is Renato de Castro and this is Smart City Trends. In the video today, we are going to Sao Paulo to visit a very nice project. However, Sao Paulo is the biggest city in Brazil and the most important financial center. It's not the main smart city project. Actually, it's listed as number two in the Brazilian local rank. Among all the exciting local projects, we decided to visit the Smart Echo House, a unique project in the whole Latin American market. The project of the house was fully designed and developed by Mr. John Barasal, a Brazilian electronic engineer. But the idea of doing an ecological smart home came from his son in 2010, when he was just four years old. The boy had contact with the subject on a project in the kindergarten. So he decided to put down the old house and build a brand new one by himself. And the first step was to look for sponsors and partners. The idea was very well accepted and he got more than 50 partnerships with local and global companies. It was the beginning of Echo House Brazil, the first autonomous smart house of Latin America, integrating cutting-edge technologies and sustainable solutions for energy, water and automation. It was a project 100% eco-friendly since the first brick. Several building materials from the old house, such as the wood and the bricks, were reused to build the new house. The old roof structure, for example, was used to do some of the furniture as we can see there. And the old traditional solid bricks from the 60s were used as a modern style decoration for the walls. The core idea was not to do a living lab, but a real house for a family. A place where they could understand and experience all the concepts behind smart city theory with information and communication technology directly applied to make our lives better. According to John, his house helped us to understand that it's not necessary to sacrifice our daily comfort in order to be more sustainable. One of the most remarkable projects in the house is the electric energy production. Two systems are available the traditional solar panels connected to the city grid and an off-grid small wind generator developed in partnership with a Japanese company. The clean wind energy is used to power almost all the electronic devices in the house, including the data center. It can also supply the house eight continuous hours of lightning in case of a blackout. The house is able to produce monthly almost five times more energy than it consumes. The extra off-grid energy is currently stored in normal car battery. But John is already looking for a global partner interested in showcase a new home batteries technology. The extra on-grid energy produced by the solar panels are 100% sold back to the local distributor. Let's check now some sustainable technologies they use in the house.
and the new solutions were also applied in the outside areas of the house. As barbecue is very popular in Brazil, John decided to make it also more sustainable. The Smart Eco House project costs 40% more than a normal house, and the estimated payback time is around 6 years. But if you still consider all the benefits for the environment, it's definitely worth And that's all! I hope you have enjoyed it, and see you in the next video!